here are two food boxes, a blue apron box and a box modeled on the DC area senior food assistance program. Blue Aprons Box is part of a delivery service that costs $45.94 per week for three boxes, serving two people. Inside are ingredients and a recipe card to help you make your own meal. The Senior Food Assistance Box, on the other hand, is paid for by the government. It's about $22 per box and contains a bunch of assorted packaged food that really isn't meant to combine into one meal. As part of a budget proposal slashing billions of dollars from food stamps, President Trump is suggesting replacing food stamps with food boxes. The Department of Agriculture calls this the America's Harvest Box proposal. According to White House Budget Director Mick Mulvaney, So what we do propose that for folks who are on food stamps, part of their benefits come in the actual sort of blue apron type program where you actually receive the food instead of re receive the cash. Under the current food stamp system, 43.6 million Americans receive an average of $125 per month in paper coupons or virtual disbursements that they can use as cash to buy food of their choice at grocery stores. Through the Harvest Box proposal, all households receiving more than $90 per month in stamps, that's about 81% of SNAP households overall, would begin receiving about half their benefits in the form of government-purchased, non-perishable food items that they can't choose themselves. A spokesperson for the Department of Agriculture said that the Harvest Box proposal was directly modeled on the Senior Food Box program in order to cut the budget and save cost. And it estimates that it could supply box goods at about half the cost of retail, which just about lines up with what our Senior Food Assistance Box, a government-paid service, was able to accomplish. Yet food policy experts are still skeptical, and our Blue Apron box shows why. The average cost of a Blue Apron meal is about 10 bucks per person. Under the food stamp system, the average, about $1.37 per person. Not only that, about one third of the cost of Blue Apron purchases goes to shipping and logistics, a problem harvest boxes will surely have to face. An administrator within the Department of Agriculture wrote that states can determine their own methods of connecting people with their harvest boxes, so nonprofits or the private sector could help with shipping costs. Trump's proposal will also likely face opposition from retailers. Walmart, Target, and other supermarkets stand to lose money if food stamps are cut. The administration says harvest boxes would help cut more than $213 billion from food stamps over the next decade. But in the end, Congress has the final say over spending, and whether this proposal goes through. And as you can see, despite Mulvaney's analogy, Blue Apron and Harvest Box have little resemblance, other than the cardboard box.